Yeah, what's good everybody? It's your boy Al Pie King Carter here. I want to welcome you guys to a brand new video. Today is finally the day where we get some my career news, man. Listen, not only has it been long awaited, a lot of people were actually getting pissed off at 2K's practices and their news media rollout. It's been a terror on social media. You understand me? Listen, if anybody out there had been waiting, the time is now. Now, listen, a quick brief recap. We got NBA, my NBA, well, NBA, my NBA, my NBA. Then we got the my NBA eras. We also got my team news. We also got the W news. All of that stuff you guys can find on everybody else's channel here on YouTube. But I'm here to talk about my career. That's what I'm here to talk about. It's time to get down to the nitty gritty. The first trailer has dropped. It's going to be a lot more information dropping as well. I'm going to pop a screenshot up on screen. This is the media rollout for the next couple of days. So obviously you already know how I get down. All the days that you see this content coming out from my career, expect a video from me, of course. Anything that got to do with the city, online, all of that, expect a video from me, of course. But now, without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into the trailer. Real quick, before I hit this play button, I want to let you guys know that today's rollout is a little bit different. Um, I am a part of the 2K Next Makers program, so we do get hd content and information from the 2k team and i would do want to thank them for all the information that they've been giving us up until now but today was a little different it is thursday the first september and we have been yet to receive any media asset kit from 2k so the reason why i'm going to be watching this on youtube is because of that i know normally you guys are watching 4k or 1080p content from me that you see me play on my desktop but for today i'm going to be playing a youtube video now just to be honest with you the video is in 4k but we already know that losslessness quality that you would be able to see gets broken down on youtube all right for copyright reasons this video will be muted haha -ha. yeah they got some song i got i came back from the win now the first thing that you notice is that they have some new gear um leather jackets and uh, three layer chains, of course. I'm saying you got your 18 inch, your 20 inch, and your 24 inch. I'm guessing, as far as chains go, as well as him being in Charlotte. We also do notice that the frames of the glasses are a little different. Um, they look like the ones from from years past, but you know, I ain't gonna lie, my man, my man's shining right there. He's a hater, but he's shining for real. <laughs> American Express to side, okay, same Brandon, cool. Oh, uh, here we go with Perkins. Um, did the Hornets make a mistake drafting MP over Shep Owens? So, um, it looks like MP is still going to be your name for your character, of course. And Shep Owens is going to be your rival going into the league. So, you know what I'm saying? It looks like, um, is that JJ Reddick right there? Is that JJ? Um, Jordan accessories, of course, Jordan branded logos. Um, I'm guessing that this player is in Charlotte simply because Jordan is on the cover. It's a nice way to pay homage to Jordan, of course, because of the uh, Charlotte Hornets. Um, Kia, NBA TV, NBA League Pass, New Era. It looks like branding is on par. I see Nike in the back. I see Converse. Who else we got? Who else we got? That's, that's what I see from the blur in the back. All right, so this person right here is Shep Owens. This dude is shining, but the first thing that I notice is that he got different tips on his beard. Of course, it's black and then it has highlighted tips. Um, I'm not sure if you could do that last year. I know a lot of people just used to have like, you know, uh, one color beards. I'm not sure if you can have tips. I don't know if that's new, but if it is cool me, I just rock the black beard. You know what I mean? All right, uh, another leather jacket. Um, we got some earrings. I see the chain clipping through the jacket, 2K. That's never a good sign. It's never a good sign. Ah, oh, it sucks. It hurts, man. It hurts. But, you know, clipping is to be expected. All right, I don't see no, I don't see no, no teeth in this, no gold, no, no diamonds, no nothing like that, but eye color different his haircut is god awful i'm so glad i'm bald all right more jordan brandon 
Hey, McGrady in your storyline. Yo, yo, this McGrady face scan is spot on, bro. Spot on, bro. Jesus. Oh, he just told that boy he ain't got no backbone. Yo, who them? Hold on, chat. Who them? I don't know who that guy is. I don't know if he works for the store for or if he's a friend or not. But he just told he just told MP he ain't got no backbone. All right, I feel like the dude with the light eyes is a is an actor that I do know. Not sure who the guy with the glasses is, but they get it's getting heated. The conversation getting heated. Was that was an off white? Was it? That was that was that shirt from last season, right? No, they they are they pants? Or it, what type of pants? You know what? I'm not even gonna question what type of pants my man got on. We're not gonna talk about it, chat. We're not gonna talk about it. All right, rise right to the challenge. Yes, sir. <laughs> Mr. Jackson Ellis still getting work out here, bro. Listen, I'm I'm glad that 2K knows the people that's within their uh realm of actors and stuff like that and they keep them around and keep them part of the storyline bro and keep people working bro you know what i'm saying i love to see that bro they keep people working like I, i'm not sure if you guys know but he is a real actor in real life i've seen him real life acting he's pretty good as well like like uh, the cheesy stuff that he does on 2k he don't he don't do that like irl like i know that y'all be like haha the little cheesy laughs and stuff like that it's not it's not like that our irl for him Mm. Hold on, nigga. I think that's. I think that's. All right. So, so peep this. I believe that in this scene right here, I believe that Jackson Ellis is a fan of the Hornets, and I'm guessing he's the radio host. And that guy right there is the GM for the other team. I'm just simply speculating this, but they're arguing over like why MP was drafted over Shep. And looking at all this, I ain't gonna lie, man. All this paraphernalia and stuff like that, that, that looks fire. They got LeBron in the back. Uh, I think that's John Morant. Um, I'm not sure if that is, I don't know who that is actually. I don't know. I ain't gonna sit up here and act like I do. That picture is dark. All right, drafted 19th overall in the 2022 draft. Shep is trash. Now, okay, I'm playing. I'm playing. I know that there are a lot of great players that come in late in the draft and stuff like that. But as far as storyline goes, that's hilarious. I remember him from the old 2K. I remember him from the old 2K. I don't know who that guy is. I don't know who he is. I don't know who he is. And he's shining back there. And what is my dude wearing, bro? Shep got to do better. I cannot lie. Shep got to do better. The haircut is cool. But the that ain't drip. I don't know what that is. That boy. Okay, more outerwear update. Um, I'm not sure if that's is that more of a overcoat type John. That's not that's not a blazer. That's 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 kind of cool. Showing the three layer chain, the effing moto pants, bro. They're still here. Yo, 2K. It is time to let the moto pants go, bro. I can't believe y'all still got these moto pants. Oh, Trey's going. Trey gonna have a fucking fit, bro. I cannot lie. Trey is gonna have a fucking fit. Oh man, wait till he hears this. Um. Uh, all right, that is JJ Reddick. Okay. All right, so I'm guessing this is the Hornets' uh assistant coach, maybe. Yeah. Who that? Okay, speculation, speculation that is his agent if that's his girlfriend then knocking her off he busting that thing down he going crazy because she giving him some real talk shit right now and it looked like they out at dinner because of the setting so maybe it might be his agent or it might be his girl let me see if you want it fight for it Play well, secure your spot. I ain't gonna lie, these these graphics, boy, they getting realer and realer. I ain't gonna lie, they getting realer and realer. I I wonder what my face scan is gonna look like 
know what I'm saying? I, like, I hope that face scan technology is crazy. I got I got an iPhone 13 Pro Max, so that's where I'm going to be scanning my face with. But I'm I'm hoping that I look graphically cool like this without the sunburnt middle of my goddamn face. Just, you know what I'm saying? The whole middle of my face just is sunburnt. <laughs> All right. Hold on, two on two, winner take shoes. Okay. Valid. Um, Nike Brandon. He on the Jordan Brandon. Alright, he got his Kobe's on. Uh, Alright. I know who that is, obviously. Obviously, we know who it is. Cold world. Alright, let me see if I notice anything here. I I, I like the hand gesture for calling the play. I like that. I like that. He looked like he looked like he a layup demon for real. He got he got he got dunk on something. Hold on. Who that his little sister? Is that his little sister? Hold on. It's not just the moves, it's the attitude. That might be his stylist or his designer or or his dance teacher or his artist development. I don't know. I don't know. It's uh oh hold on let me find a hold on not nah 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 I saw that drip bro I saw that drip bro hold on bro bro what you wearing bro nah bring it back bring it back bring it back what is you wearing in the booth bro what what is what is that shirt what's that drip my man got a white leather on you know what I'm saying I don't I don't know what's going on boy he wearing all white boy Easter ooh. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Jersey over the T. Hold up. Jersey over the T. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Jersey over the T. I like it. Chain over the jersey. I f I'm I'm effing with it. I'm effing with this right here. I'm effing with this. This this whole this whole setup right here. Now, if you could throw a jean jacket on top of this or something like that, like that'd be fire. All right. We coming back to the blazer triple chain. My oh boy, love them Dutch Simon earrings. Ooh, hold on. Wait a minute, chat. I need that step back. Hey, chat. I need y'all to write inside the comment section what step back this is. I know Stax Montana might know. I need this step back, though. I need this one. Hold on. Bang. I need that, John. I need people falling all over the place. Ew, Dreamer gear. You know what that mean. Check the shops. Check the shops. You know what I'm saying? The Dreamer wear going to be definitely dropping. You know what I'm saying? I wonder if Bosch uh, stuff going to be uh, dropping, too. Okay, yeah, that's it. That's his dance teacher. Oh yeah, we dunking. Oh, and we get posters too. Hold up, so we can lay up, we can shoot movements, we can dunk, we can do all that. Chat, yo, listen, my my small forward finna go crazy. MP for finals MVP. All right, so he's back. So I'm guessing he's a personal manager, maybe. Maybe he's back as a personal manager. And and he said something about the city, so you know we gotta talk about this. Okay, 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 okay. So check this out. I noticed that it's little areas like like right here, right? We already know what this is. This is the Wildcat courts. This is the uh, Viper courts. This is the Beast of the East courts. This is the Knights courts. But I think that this right here may be the Kobe court. Um, I also believe that this may be the new arena, or is this the is, or is this still the arena? Because this got the four ways to like. Everywhere you need to go. I want to know what all this is. It's, the city look bigger, actually. The city look the city look bigger. And, and, and some of these things are highlighted. But I also want to know, like, why? Okay, hold on. Nice court. What's this big monument over here? Is this going to be an event spot that, that pops up? Is this going to be an event spot that pops up? Um, what is 
is all this yellow? Is this something to be conquered? Or is this just like the business district? Like where's all the shopping gonna go down at? This this layout looks huge. Chat, give me your give me your thoughts. Because as it stands right now, the rec center, the rec center is in the middle, off to the off to the edge right here, right? Like if we're if we're looking at it, no, we might have to flip it. If we flip it, this is where like the rec center and stuff would be because the beast of the East Court is that way. And this was where the the knights would spin the wheel or the no, the beast, the beast of the East would spin, spin the wheel here. Then it was the Gatorade place over here, plus the 2K club over here. Then knights would spin the wheel here. So this would be like where the rec pro-am and the ante up was at on this side. And this was the Viper side. So all of this here was like shopping and stuff like that. Like that's where all this stuff was. Then you had up here, you had like some of the storyline stuff. Then you had the, the uh, Beast of the East joint. Then there was more shopping little like stores over here, but it's a court right there. I can see, I can see a court right here. So that may be uh, either a um, Black Lives Matter court or uh, some 5v5 or 1v1. Some, ty some type of court is over there for sure. Um, also... We had like a couple shops over here and like um I believe it was like the 3v3 open gym or the, the court versus the CPUs was over here somewhere. Then it was the nights and then like you had your apartment, like that whole strip of the brickly stuff over here. So I, I really want to know what this layout is going to look like. And it looks like this is a court right here and it like all paths lead to like this little court here. But I want to know what this court may be. Maybe this might be the Black Lives Matter court or something. I'm not sure. And like, I don't see like any other little like garage courts and stuff like that. Well, it looked like this might be a court here. All the anticipation and the the information I'm trying to get from this is like, I wish I could see more. Like, I wish I wish in this joint they could have stuff popping up, like telling me what it is, bro. From what I see here. I feel like the first trailer actually showed us what the storyline is going to look like. Obviously, we already know you're going to start out, get drafted, have a rival, and then you're essentially going to get into the music business. I didn't see anything that said fashion, but also last year, we didn't see anything really about music and fashion until everything started coming together. And like, you know what I mean? Around like the last couple of days of the news cycle. So hopefully you know with the drip he had on all these other jackets and blazers and stuff like that maybe that's the fashion aspect of it but hopefully they're focusing more on music and obviously music was the the focal point of last year's game because if you did the music stuff right you got your penthouse and everything like that but i hope i pray to god that they got a mock court of some sort and stuff like that that we could play in invite our friends to and host tourneys and stuff like that and i pray to you 2k i pray that you guys implemented that but I'm not going to hold you guys up too much longer. I know y'all be like, yo, I pocket turn a two minute video into an hour long uh, breakdown. So I'm going to go ahead and leave it there. I appreciate everybody for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Also, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe. Make sure you guys turn on notice. And I'll see you all in the next video. Peace. King Kong. King Kong. King Kong. King Kong, King Kong, King Kong, I'm King Kong, King Kong.